Good Friday morning. Me and Dale were just laughing like hysterically because when I came out of paying my bill, he was standing outside the car and I was, we have this joke about like trying to run, like trying to, you know, run away like I've kidnapped him. And so we were laughing. I was like, trying to run again, huh? And so he was like, I was just getting the baby's tater tots up out of the floor. And I was like, yeah, sure you were. And so next time I'm going to handcuff you to the little railing, which is like right there of the car next time you try to run and then we were laughing because I was like you know can't you imagine like some little old lady like walking up next to the car getting in hers and he's all handcuffed to the right and then he was talking about yeah he said my bounty hunter name would be frog which is funny and he was like she's such a badass she left me in her car with her kid and I was like he's my backup <laughs> talking about Riley being my backup because he's got this thing where he does this look and he goes like this with his finger so yeah but we're getting gas put in my car right now um i'll show you but dale's like really close to the gas tank in the car paying some bills got me some starbucks got dale some um sonic and riley some sonic i'm kind of like staying away from sonic because it's really weird i got like really sick after eating sonic so yeah just kind of stay away from it but we got to go do all kinds of fun busy stuff so and it's really cold so yeah hence why I'm wearing a hat yeah I know huh. but it was actually snowing a little bit when we came into town not like enough to be like you know out there playing in like loads and loads of snow but like you could see it and it was it was sticking to a couple of spots but yeah it's pretty cold Dale's pretty cold Riley had a hat on but he didn't throw it off on the floor but look at this player with his all crazy looking hat <laughs> what no don't take it off oh he's in a foul mood this morning y'all can only imagine he had to wait to get his breakfast till he came to town because I was out of milk because I gave it all to his brothers <laughs> so now he's being made to sit here and wait to get his juice he just threw his tater tots on the floor oh <gasps> All right, I'll turn the camera off. So, we just got out of Walmart. Hope you guys can see me. My head's probably got cut off. Robert just turned up my hair. Anyways, we just got out of Walmart from getting our new bedding and stuff that we needed, basic stuff, toilet paper, laundry detergent and stuff. And a couple goodies. I think Dell's most excited about his new underwear he got. <laughs> He's excited about the array of colors. But we're having lunch in the car. Went by Wendy's. Got number one. I have not had Wendy's in forever, but that is good. Really good. Got a strawberry, what was it, lemonade? Yeah. I mean, this is good, too. Everything's you get? good when you're hungry. A number one yeah. cheese. He got a... Root beer? Yeah, a root beer. I thought it was a strawberry tea. But it is so good. It just looks good. Riley's in the back eating his chips, though. We're going to finish up our lunch date in the car. Dale's going to run and go get his medicine. I had to go get some thinning shears. And then I think we got to run somewhere for a tire or something or another. And then to Lowe's. And I think we're almost done. Then we'll be heading home and I'll get to show you guys everything I bought. Is that about it? Yeah. And you guys going to be there to uh, fix the leak in the bathroom. Oh yeah, the guy's coming to fix the leak in the bathroom. Um, hopefully. Hopefully. Notice I said hopefully. Cause it's leaking we put a bucket underneath it and the bucket was like overflowing that's a huge problem we put one underneath the bathroom uh the master bathroom faucet to see if that one was leaking too so i'm kind of curious to see how much water has leaked out just since we left but yeah look at my burger y'all i know all up in your face look at that burger it's good Did you get him? Yep, I'm recording him right now. <laughs> Little player is asleep eating tater chips. She grabbed me some thinning shears from Sally's. To be honest with you, I have never used thinning shears. Yeah. I am a bit um, scared <laughs> to use these, but I guess it's kind of like a learn situation, you know, live and learn type thing. 
Uh, I definitely need some because the boys, um, especially like the twins, their hair is a lot thicker uh, than like Brody and Riley's. And when I give them haircuts, I always notice on top it just needs to be thinned out just a little bit. So I'm kind of hoping this will do the trick. Um, when I asked the girl um, like which one she would recommend, she gave me like a whole bunch of them. There was like, when I went in there the first time, she told me, well, the one girl, she showed me one pair and they were like $30 and I was like, jeez, you know. <laughs> so I didn't buy them and then I was like, well, I don't need them. I so need them. <laughs> so I went and this time she laid out like 10 of them. So I picked out these and I hope, I really hope these do the job. So I don't know. I hope so. Hopefully it'll work. I'm gonna, I think just for like, you know, just for safety reasons or whatever you want to call it, I'm going to watch a couple of videos um, on how to use them just before I start chopping hair. <laughs> you know? <laughs> My poor kids. <laughs> Mommy just chops their hair all up. They have been, they've sported a couple of bad haircuts, I ain't gonna lie. Especially when I first started out with cutting their hair. They sported a couple of um, rough looking haircuts. I mean, it's just, it's just a learning thing, you know? So, hopefully it all goes well and hopefully it does what I want it to do. Dale has run in lows while he's back there taking a nap with a chip stuck in his mouth. <laughs> Look at all that stuff in the back of my car. That's my new comforter. I'm going to show you guys up close. We got some new pillows. I'm in love with those pillows. Oh my gosh. They are like the best things ever. I was holding on to it and like it's memory foam and you like squeeze it and then it like just kind of flops back out. And then the whole like whole sad disturbing part of it, Dale's like, but we can't use them until the new bed comes. I'm like, oh my gosh. I about like broke down crying. I was like, no. I don't think my bed's coming today, yo guys. Because on the little thing it said that they will call you to schedule like a delivery um, set up, date, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I guess somebody needs to be there or whatever. Um, so they haven't called, so it's probably not today. But I put in the order last night for Brody's little TV and Riley's little mini sleeping bag. So I'm waiting for my bed, my foundation, Brody's curtains, Brody's TV, the uh, sleeping bag, and I think that's it. But the good news is, while I was at Walmart, I showed Dale these dressers that I'd been checking out. And he said, yeah, these are like really good dressers. They're really good and sturdy. And I was like, yeah, they're 100 bucks a piece. So right now, of course, I don't like just have $400 to just, you know, spend on dressers. So I think we're just going to get like one at a time. Um, I think that would just, you know, it makes sense. I mean, you guys know what I mean. I'm not rich. I mean, <laughs> sorry, I'm not. I mean, if I was, I would do some good stuff with it. But I just don't have $400 to just you know, divvy out on dressers right now, but the good news is we did find some. I did show him the headboard that I've been looking at, and he liked that. So hopefully within the next month or two, we'll have um, four dressers and a headboard, and I will actually feel like something has been accomplished. So yeah, pretty good So we're in the um, older boy's room. Dell's trying his new stud finder out. There's one right there. He's over there trying to see where the best place to mount the um, twins' TV is. Oh, yeah. And so he pulls out their little, like, temporary Don't. TV stand. Don't. Daniel's so going to kill me. I won't read the whole thing, okay? But we found a little love letter or song Daniel is writing. And it is so funny saying that he thinks about her, dreams about her. And then he was saying, I love you, baby. Hit it. And me and Daniel are like, what is he hitting? It is so funny. It's cute, but oh my gosh, if this is the beginning to... Uh, Future pervdom? Yeah! <laughs> then, oh my god, it's not cute anymore. Well... Those... You gotta redo these, because that's uh, hitting that door. Why did you hang these? Uh, you hung those there, sweetheart. Why did I hang these <laughs> See, why did I hang these here? I don't know. We'll probably have to move those a little bit later on, though, but... He's just having too much fun with this little stud finder. He got it Lowe's for, I think, 20 bucks. So, too much fun though, but I got all my bedding stuff in there. I'll take you guys in there, like with my real camera, um, a little bit later and show you. But I thought it was so cute. I had to <laughs> show you guys Daniel. Hey, stop with that basket. Get that seat. I knew that's what he was going at. Are you pointing up at me? Pointing both of y'all. Okay. 
we have reached a thousand subscribers and so I said that if we reached a thousand subscribers that we were going to do a victory dance. So Daniel is going to be my partner in the Slope Against Snows and we're going to do a victory dance. Are you ready? Okay. You go plus. <laughs> Alright, do the Spongebob victory dance. The points of ears. <laughs> so the handyman, hand, yeah, handyman, handyman, man, the handyman and his son <laughs> just left. Um, we were waiting on them to come out. We thought he was going to fix the shower in the um, little boys' bathroom, like the small room. He was coming out to put in the toilet, the sink, uh, he brought like the fan, light little thing, all of that stuff. So that's what they've been working on for the past couple of hours. Um, Dale and I got my curtains hung in the bedroom. Kids are back there playing. But um, yeah, pretty excited. Yeah, I never knew I'd be that excited to like get a new toilet. I mean really the little things that excite me. Um, but speaking of excited, I'm super excited as you just seen uh, that I reached a thousand, which I know some people's like, oh, it's a thousand. Still, that's a thousand more friends than what I had. So, in honor of that, I did get a P.O. box. So, in the bottom of this video, I will leave the P.O. box. So, if you guys want to send fan mail or whatever. Mom. You guys have it. I yes. made a, I made a Lego and it's like a machine. Oh wow, looks pretty cool. Pretty sophisticated, my man. I made one um, about he knows everything. He's like, yeah. So yeah, pretty excited. Um, once I finish editing here, I'm gonna take you guys and show you the new stuff in the boys' bathroom, and I'll show you the curtains in my bedroom. And bam. <gasps> yeah, check out my curtains. Got him hung up. It only took Dale half a day. No, not really. It only took him about 30 minutes, but that's what they look like. He actually put together the bed frame for our bed, so <laughs> we're just waiting for that, as you all know. He hung the curtain up over there. Here's our bedding stuff. We got these amazing yeah. beauty rest pillows. Oh my gosh, yeah, you guys have got to check these out. Amazing. Got me some new sheets. They're like this really pretty, like wine hey, grape Mom. looking color. What, you doing? what are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, hey, really pretty. And I then like my comforter. Thing. It's like it's a lockbox, buddy. Hold on. And then I keep what? Uh, Stefan. That's what my comforter looks oh, like. Cool. Pretty cool. Yeah. I know. Um, sometime. <laughs> sometime. Oh look, Preston's doing the victory dance too. <laughs> so thank you for subscribing. Yeah, thank you for subscribing. Mom, what's the number? <laughs> Mom, what's the number? I can't tell you the number. Don't mess with it. All right, let's go and get dessert. One, two, four, so, eight, seven. Totally. So yeah, eight? pretty excited eight? about that. But yeah. I'm gonna show you guys the um the boys' bathroom that me and Dell are kind of playing with the idea of now painting. Huh? I I'm showing them all the hard work. I have a unique one. So. I know, it is so messy in here. Like, it's raining outside and they've tracked in stuff. <laughs> Let me show you guys. Bam! So, yeah. They put in this, which there was not one there. All there was there was just a sink. That's it. And then this new toilet. I'm so excited. He's going to come back and put some, like, um... He's going to level it out and put some trim work around the bottom and then there's supposed to be a new fan put in and as you see it's really dark and tan and stuff so we're talking about painting it. So yeah. Make it look a lot better. Yeah, now we've just got to paint it and make it look like a million times better. There's some supplies on the table. But me and Dale are like really rooting for a new toilet in the master bathroom. We never knew how badly we would want a new toilet until they brought that one in and we were like, we must have one. So we're hoping for one. He's uh, getting the kids some path. So we finally reached a thousand subscribers, Dale. What do you have to say to that? Yay! <laughs> he doesn't sound too excited. But yeah, we're excited. So, 
Yeah, I guess we're gonna have some oh. dessert, and then we're gonna call it a night because we gotta hit town early to get tomorrow. And then we have money. Yeah, we'll spend their money there, oh, and then more people are coming out tomorrow. Hey, yeah. I can't even know. tell what you are. Me, a ninja. Oh You're a ninja. Well, you can't see. Yeah. Yeah, but we got um the guy that's supposed to be coming out to look at um the. AC and the heat because they're going to put a new system on the house and then uh, the handyman and his son oh, hey, 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 hey. That are coming back out. Was his. Come get the smaller piece. So yeah, busy day that tomorrow. Piece is his. Busy, busy. So I guess the one... smallest piece, the one you have. Anyway, so I guess we're going to go ahead and say good night and we'll see you guys tomorrow for an awesome Saturday. Good night, guys. Good night, guys. Good night. 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 Good night.